welcome back to the channel guys it is me 80s multiple force today guys we're predicting the uefa conference league qualifying rounds and i want you guys to do the same in the comments with these guys remember guys this is the first round guys 31 team 31 matchups and so we have 62 teams competing guys a lot of things to go through so please remember guys this will not be in-depth analysis this will just be a quick fire predictions as so you guys let me know your predictions in the comments below Next up, the first matchup we have is Nikasic versus Cosmos. I'm going to go Nikasic to advance. I just feel like they have a way better team. And I just don't really favor Cosmos, even though the second leg is at home. Then we have Domzil versus um, Balzan. I'm going to go with Domzil to advance. I just feel like, for me, they have a much better team. And, yeah, I just don't really favor them that well. And I feel like they could win the first leg by a good score, more, by a decent margin. Next up is Vaduz versus Neyman Gordono. Now, remember, guys, Vaduz did make the last season's conference league. And so this is going to be very interesting for them. Can they do it again? Uh, I mean, I, I think they can definitely do it. I mean, they're going against um, Nerman Gordusso, and obviously they're from Belarus. So I don't think this is a terrible matchup for them. I think this is a good matchup for them. So hopefully they can continue their fairy tale story and qualify. Next up is Arid Armana versus Egnetica. Egnetia. Um, this is a very interesting one. I am actually going to go with Egnetia to advance on this one. I feel like the home leg and second, second leg will be massive. And I feel like um, I just don't really trust um, this Armenian team to do well on the road. Okay. Next up, it is Topordio Kortiski versus Savary Go. I am going to go with. Um, it's a very interesting one, guys. I am going to go with Kutesi to advance. I feel like Bosnian team is kind of underperformed. National team and club football, so I'm going to go with them. Then Alskaret versus Arsenal Tivit. Now, I believe Alskaret, I think they were in the Conference League a few seasons ago, so I'm going to go with Alskaret to advance. Then Zurich Zelenicki versus Dynamo Minsk. I'm gonna go with um I'm gonna go with Zelensky advance on this one. Then we have Law Florita versus Zembrio Cristino. I'm gonna go with Zembrio Cristino to adv Cisno to advance. Sorry. Maribor versus Brukari. I think Maribor was in the conference like a few seasons ago, so I'm gonna go with them. Then Tirani versus Dynamo Batuma. Very, very good matchup. Possibly the best matchup on the round. It's a very, very tricky one. I'm gonna go Dynamo Batumi though to advance simply because the second leg's at home. That we have Bruno's Max Prize versus Dundalek. Dundalek should be advancing. Uh, Inter Club de Escalades versus Viking Gore is a very interesting one. I believe um, Inter Club de Escalades, they dropped down from the Champions League. And um, it's a very, very interesting one. You know what? I'm going to go with upset. Something tells me Viking Gore should win. I'm going to go with Inter Club de Escalades, though. I think they're going to pull out a result. Next up is Progress. Nedurikin versus Gugini. This is going to be an interesting one. I'm going to go progress to advance on this one. The Luxembourg team. Then we have Linfield versus um, Vilzeni. I'm going to go with Linfield to advance. Then we have Ka, Ka versus Kone Kore uh, Nomads. I'm going to go with um, Kone Kwe Nomads to advance. Shkindi versus Havers County. Um, I'm going to go Shkindi to advance. Haka versus Crusaders. A very, very interesting matchup. I am going to go with I'm going to go with Hakka to advance. HB Tor, um, Torsvan versus Dury City. I'm going to go with Dury City to advance. Riga versus Viking Gore. Reykjavik. I believe... Um, I think they also dropped... I think they... Um, did they drop down for the Champions League? Hold up. Let me check. I think they did, right? I... I, I remember one of the Icelandic teams. Let me see. Did they drop down for the Champions League? I'm pretty sure they did. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Ne never mind. I'm probably talking about another team. Sorry. Um... Yeah, yeah, I don't think it's them. Anyways, I'm going to go with Viking Gore to advance. Zilini versus FC Levidia. I'm going to go Zilini to advance. Punic versus Albert Torrance. I'm going to go Punic to advance. I believe they were in the conference a few seasons ago. Uh, Panzavis versus Milseri Ori. I'm going to Panzavis to advance. Then Tobol versus Honka. You know what? I'm going to go with an upset, guys. I'm going to go with uh, Tobol to advance as one of the Kazakhstan teams. Dunshki straight up versus Diliguri. I'm going to go with Dunshki uh, straight up to advance. Baikonur GP versus RFS. I'm going to go with RFS to advance on this one, guys. And then look at this, guys. We have a club called Europa playing in the Europa the club. <laughs> you know, it, it's very, very interesting. You know what? Just because of their name, guys, I'm going to go with them to qualify. Europa to beat du Dukinji. Genji. Pennevoet versus FC Santa Cloma. I'm going to go with um, Pennyboat to advance. Then Helgeland men versus Scrippy. I'm going to go Scrippy to advance. Scrippy should be advancing for that one. And F91, Dundalich versus St. Patrick's Athletics. That's a very interesting one. I'm going to go with St. Patrick's Athletics to advance on this one. Dorsevi versus Pind Lenmix Gade. I'm going to go with um, Dorsevin to advance. 
and Gizri United versus Biltron, I am going to go with Gizri United to advance. So, the, there you have it, guys, the first qualifying round. Let's quickly look at the second qualifying round very, very briefly. And you can see some of the matchups have already been decided. And some interesting ones to, uh, to happen here. So, please, like I said, guys, let me know your predictions or comments below, guys. We went through a lot, 31 matchups. So, please, remember, guys, like and subscribe. Comment below your thoughts, comment section below. And, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. And also, oh, one last thing. Become a member of the channel for only 99 cents per month to get access to members' videos and members' streams.